Today, practices for fall sports could start across Alabama, and several districts in North Alabama are taking advantage of each day. Way 31's Max Cohan went to Decatur. As he reports, the football coach, players, and parents don't seem too concerned about coronavirus there. According to head coach Jerry Adcock, only two players have opted out of the season. He added that all those that they've expected to show up were at practice on Monday. Monday, football players returned to practice at Decatur High School, but it looked a lot different than last season. Melissa Dickman's son plays quarterback. She explained why she's comfortable with the safety measures the team is taking. They are on top of it and making sure that they have every procedure covered and telling and advising these young men the best procedures and what to do. The team is taking temperatures each day when players arrive. They are then sprayed from the elbow down with sanitizer, and all of their gear and equipment is also sprayed down. Players are also asked to keep their distance, something that isn't always easy playing football. Kristen Taylor's son Charlie is a senior. She says one of the reasons she let him play is because he spent the last four years looking forward to it. And I just think this virus really isn't going anywhere right now, and. We just have to get back to some sort of normalcy and doing things we love. And for Charlie, that's playing football. The women aren't overly worried about players bringing the virus home. It's a matter of time, maybe before we all maybe get it. But um, right now, everyone seemed to fare well with it. And not from playing football, I don't have those concerns. On top of everything else, Coach Adcock added that every time there are players in the weight room, they wipe down all the equipment and then fog the room, something he does again the next morning before anybody else comes in. Reporting in Decatur, Max Cohan, Way 31 News.